Today, I'm going to show you how to install NVIDIA graphics drivers properly. So, you can automate this process, but um, a lot of the times you don't get the best, the optimal and the cool drivers that you really want. So in this little tutorial, I'm going to show you how to manually install the optimal drivers that you need for your graphics card that will give you the full NVIDIA control panel as well as make sure that you select the right driver. Gmodism, total nerdry channel. To download NVIDIA drivers, we will go to a web browser and type in NVIDIA Advanced Search. I have a link to this in the description that you can open easily. On this page, we'll need to figure out what type of graphics cards driver we will download. To do that, we will right click on the Windows icon and select Device Manager. Inside Device Manager, we will look for Display Adapters. We shall expand this and under here, we can see our graphics cards. The NVIDIA GeForce GTX 950M is ours. So we will write in product type GeForce Operating System Windows 11, GeForce 900M series, the M series or the Notebook series and the without M are standard. Windows driver type, select standard. The DHC driver isn't very good and it lacks control panel. And I will just select recommended slash certified and download the latest GeForce Game Ready driver. We'll just click on that and we'll come to the download page. Here we can get some information and just click download. If you have a previous uh, DHC driver, you may have NVIDIA control panel via Microsoft Store. This control panel isn't very good, however, so I would recommend you remove that control panel from Microsoft Store and just install the proper standard drivers instead. Now, when it's downloaded, we can uh, run the exe file, that is the display adapter uh, install. So we'll just let it extract. It can take a couple of minutes, but uh, just leave it be and it will then check system compatibility. If you have selected the wrong drivers, it will tell you here. We did select a correct driver, however, so we can now proceed to select NVIDIA graphics drivers and GeForce Experience or just the graphics drivers. If you use NVIDIA Shadowplay, you need GeForce Experience. For all other users, I would recommend you to not install GeForce Experience. Now select custom install option and click next. And here I will select perform a clean installation. This will remove some older junk and older drivers and uh, it's good to do this. If uh, you have previous drivers, maybe DHC drivers before, then I would definitely perform a clean install. Or if you are installing your uh, drivers first time on Windows 11, I would definitely perform a clean install. It will remove old Windows 10 drivers. Now it has proceeded and installed and everything went absolutely fine. So that is fantastic. And if it failed, it will tell you here. Now we will check that we actually have NVIDIA control panel active and ready and it should be in the taskbar here. If we just close this down and go down to the lower right corner and expand the taskbar, you can find NVIDIA settings. If you just click on that, you will get NVIDIA control panel. And inside here, you can do your usual NVIDIA control panel settings. Now we shall expand the uh, device manager and just check the driver version. And here we can see the date of the driver. Very nice. We successfully got the latest driver. That's fantastic. So now we can go ahead and change whatever settings we want in control panel. And there we have it. You now have the latest NVIDIA drivers on your computer. And if this tutorial helped you, you should definitely leave a like and do, of course, subscribe so that you can catch our latest tech tutorials every Tuesday. We also got a lot of gaming content, so check that out, and I'll see you next time. This is your host, Jim Adesma, signing out.